Hey there, it is Kelly from Making Health Matter. Today I'm going to talk about jojoba oil. I am going to tell you why I like it, what I use it for, and give you some tips on buying it. Now who doesn't want to take care of their skin? We all do. We want to make sure that we are aging nicely and that our skin is soft. And we get rid of any potential blemishes that might make us look like we are not taking care of ourselves. Well, I have a fragrance allergy and it makes it a little bit more tricky to find products that don't have any fragrance for one because I will react and two that don't have a lot of chemicals. So I discovered jojoba oil. This has been a game changer for me. It actually mimics the natural oils in your skin. So even though you feel like you might be putting on an oil and you think your skin will be oily, it actually isn't oily at all. It goes onto your skin, it actually blends in very nicely, and it makes your skin feel so super soft. This has antioxidants in it, it has anti-inflammatory properties, and the most amazing thing is it's one ingredient, jojoba oil. So you're not flipping over the bottle trying to figure out what all these ingredients are. You know exactly what is in this bottle. Now, not only is jojoba oil good for your skin, you can use it on your face, you can use it on your entire body, but it's also fabulous for your hair. If you have a dry scalp or you want to nourish your hair or your scalp, you just put jojoba oil right in. You can actually put it right into your um, shampoo or conditioner, or often what I will do is just put it right on my scalp, Sometimes I'll put it on overnight and just let it sink in and help to nourish and then wash it out in the morning. You can even put it on the tips of your hair if you want to make sure that it keeps it nice and healthy. So an overall fantastic product. An important tip when you're buying jojoba oil um, that I didn't know when I bought this one is that it should be bought in a glass bottle that is tinted dark. So here is a tinted like brown bottle. This is not jojoba oil. This is actually castor oil. Love this oil as well. Um, and it can either come in a like this dark brown or a dark blue. Jojoba oil is light sensitive. And so if you, you buy it in a dark glass bottle, then it is going to protect it from oxidization and going rancid. rancid. You all the other thing you wanna make sure is that your jojoba oil is cold pressed um, and unrefined and that way it will be um, natural. Now I don't wear makeup, but I have heard that jojoba oil is amazing at removing any makeup. So if you need it as a makeup remover, you can also use it for that. So there you have it. I highly recommend jojoba oil. I know you won't be disappointed. It is chemical free. You cannot go wrong with something that has one ingredient, is all natural and feels fantastic on your skin. I hope you found this review helpful. If you did, make sure you give it a like, subscribe below, and thank you for joining me on Making Health Matter.